hey everyone uh, welcome to my channel and here uh, i'm here with a new video of flutter uh, and that's websocket and uh, you, you so many developers flutter developers uh, want to know and uh, try to implement uh, websocket uh, in flutter app and uh, so many times client expect or uh, demand that uh, we need to implement websocket in flutter so i'm gonna uh, expose or uh, show you how to implement this WebSocket Flutter WebSocket in Flutter app uh, within the shortest time. So here you can see, uh, in the, this is our main screen. Here I, uh, in home screen, I take a, a custom widget, Flutter WebSocket. And within this, this is, I take a stateful widget. And here is the app bar, name WebSocket. And here I uh, take a text field and there is a stream builder and a Flutter uh, a floating action button. The, all are simple things you can see here. Okay. Let me start the project. All right, here you can see here is your socket, here is a text field, and here is a floating action button, and here is a, a, a circle progress. Here you can see because uh, here I set logic. If error, here is showing error, and if there is data, data will be show here receive, and if not, then there will be circular progress indicator. So there is nothing in this. Uh, stream builder that's why uh, circular progress indicator is showing so now i will show you uh, how to implement web socket in flutter app so first of all uh, you have to go uh, you have to sir, find this package okay i'm showing you so this one okay you have to uh, copy the latest one and go to pops to camel file and return this okay git pub git okay now we have to go here get dependency okay go here again and you have to copy this to line okay import this library okay we can make the code more shorter we can set these things here and remove these things okay so uh, every time client will uh, provide this link uh, websocket links but uh, right now we haven't any client and we haven't any client websocket links so we will uh, try uh, test link maximum and uh, every developer use this link for testing purpose okay okay so we got this uh, we, we got every data from this website links in this channel variable so we will implement or incorporate this in the system builder so here will be stream builder if uh, the in this channel there is uh, any error then error will be show here if there is data then it will be show here and if not then there you will show a server progress indicator and we will try to uh, send that uh, what will enter this text field that in the uh, web uh, in server through web socket so yeah already i have built this uh, function channel dot sync dot add and uh, what will enter in this text field that will be uh, moving in and database and once what is start see it's working so hello world. let's see is it working or not see here is the hello world and it's working real time uh, we, we, we don't need to uh, delay for uh, getting response so what uh, we are posting that so you can see and getting uh, from the back end uh, in real time another thing is that okay hit this one see everything is working perfectly so this is how we can implement a uh, websocket in our flutter app so every time a uh, client will provide this link then you will just change this link and uh, work and modify everything as you want so this is about uh, flutter of circuit uh, i try to make you understand within the shortest time so thanks for time to being with me and if you uh, like this video and if you, if you think it's helpful so please subscribe and like uh, to my channel and this video
So thanks for your time.